They spent how much on that? As an A-list celebrity with unlimited income and exclusive access to only the finest things in life, you're sure to splurge some ridiculous amounts of your million dollar paycheck just for accessories. We're not talking about dropping a few hundred for the newest pair of kicks, we're talking about hundreds of thousands to millions. After all, what's five million dollars a watch when you're worth billions? Let me show you how it all started. Kim's Ponytail Kim Kardashian arrived at the 2021 Met Gala in a show-stopping, face-obscuring Balenciaga outfit that inspired endless memes. As it turns out, there is even more to the story. Kim paired the bold, all-black ensemble with hair extensions that cost $10,000, according to her hairstylist, Chris Appleton. The one-time purchase was sure worth it. The 75-inch ponytail consists of only the finest extensions and a stellar amount of hair care products to ensure that ponytail photographs right. And it sure did. It was super sleek and shiny, cascading out of her ski mask? Funny enough, under her mask, Kim had a full face of makeup. Her makeup artist, Mario, let us have a look of the makeup that he did. Such a shame we didn't get to see Kim's gorgeous face. Jay-Z's watch Jay-Z received this one-of-a-kind watch as a gift for his 43rd birthday from his wife, Beyonce. The custom-made watch took 14 months and a team of 17 to create. It consists of 1,282 diamonds weighing over 100 carats, plus 18-carat white gold dial and six square emerald cut stones. Jay-Z's Hublot's Big Bang watch is estimated to be worth $5 million. Interestingly, Jay-Z's watch is the same price as the engagement ring he bought for Beyonce. Beyonce and Blue Ivy's Jewelry Queen B and Lorraine Schwartz have been longtime collaborators. Beyonce owns a lot of pricey pieces and has been gifted some too. Her most iconic red carpet jewelry pieces are by Schwartz. Beyonce has attended the Grammy Awards nearly every year for well over a decade, wearing the brand's jewels since 2004. Even her engagement ring from Jay-Z is from Lorraine Schwartz. The gorgeous ring is worth $5 million. At the 2016 VMAs, Beyonce and Blue Ivy wore $13 million worth of diamonds. Only on one hand, she has on three rings, a $1.5 million 20-carat wraparound diamond ring, a $280,000 marquee pear-shaped diamond ring, and a $600,000 7-carat mobile pinky ring. Her ears were decorated with $1.8 million emerald and intense pink diamond earrings. Blue Ivy sported a $1.5 million diamond tiara like it's no big deal. Angelina Jolie's Earrings Angelina Jolie typically keeps a low profile, but when she shows up, she shows up big. She made a statement at the 2009 Oscars wearing an astonishing pair of Lorraine Schwartz emerald earrings. The stunning emeralds really complemented her eyes. They were 115 carat, worth around $2.5 million, and said to be a part of Jolie's personal collection. Cardi B's hair it's hardly a secret that Cardi B loves changing up her look, but looking as good as she does is not cheap. In each session, Cardi spends around $1,300. A breakdown of that is $500 to $800 for each wig, plus two to $300 for a hairstylist. Sometimes the higher quality wigs can cost thousands, which can add up to $6,000. Yearly, that's really hefty just for hair. We're talking about at least $50,000. Cardi B is also known for her amazing nails. Those manicures and pedicures cost her $200 each time. It's really expensive to look as fabulous as Cardi. Kylie Jenner's Shoes Hermes is synonymous with luxury. Kylie Jenner, who is extremely rich, copped possibly one of the most expensive pairs of shoes in our lifetime. Birkenstock sandals made out of Hermes Birkin bags by Neodata brand Mischief. Retail price? Up to $76,000. To be clear, these Birkenstocks are not an official collaboration with Hermes. For this project, Mischief purchased Birkin bags and used the leather to craft these shoes. Only 10 pairs were created by Mischief. Pharrell Williams Necklace Pharrell is a rapper, singer, songwriter, record producer, fashion designer, and a trendsetter who never seems to age. He really does it all. He owns this one-of-a-kind chain made by Jacob the Jeweler in 2006, and it's made from hundreds of different colored gems. The cost of this piece is about $1.5 million. He also owns grills by Gabby Elin Jewelry worth $100,000. Victoria Beckham's Bags 
Textile icon Victoria Beckham fell in love with Hermes iconic bags ever since purchasing her first one in 2004. After decades, her collection spans over 100 purses worth around $2 million. She literally has one in every color. Her Hermes collection is one of the largest in the world. A few are gifts from her husband, David Beckham, including an albino Nilo Crocodile Himalayan Birkin, one of three in the world for $100,000. Its value only increased after David purchased it. Other stellar examples in her collection include this ostrich leather Birkin, featured in pink, worth over $150,000. Drake Sneakers the rapper's shoe collection sneakerheads worldwide marvel at. Drake's Air Jordan collaboration is one of the brand's most coveted capsules. Buying a pair of Ovo by Air Jordan 10s could go for thousands. One time, a pair sold for $100,000. At a Toronto Raptors game, Drake gave a pair to one lucky fan, who managed to sell the shoe for an incredible $100,000 on eBay. But Drake owns a more expensive one-of-a-kind custom. They're solid gold. Based on the weight of the sneakers, Drake would have to drop $2 million on these sneakers just based on gold values. Blackpink's Necklaces being one of the biggest names in K-pop has its perks, including access to the most lucrative jewels. Lisa, who recently made a solo debut with the song La Lisa, was spotted with a $1.13 million necklace from Bulgari, the double wrap serpentine necklace. Fellow Blackpink member Rosé, who also recently made a solo debut, was spotted with a very pricey necklace. At a price point of $885,000, this one-of-a-kind necklace from Tiffany & Company cannot be purchased by the public. It reported features over 57 carats of baguette sapphires and diamonds. The star of the show, the Green Emerald, consists of over 10 carats. BTS's Watches K-pop sensations BTS have an enviable collection of luxury watches. Member RM owns a rose gold Patek Philippe 5712R retailing at $57,995. That's not the most expensive watch he owns. Another watch in his collection is the Rolex Daydate Platinum at the price of $53,000. Member Jin also sports Rolex Daydates, but in the color gold rose, which retails for $32,000, and another in white gold with diamonds for $100,000. Suga and J-Hope have matching watches, Audemars Piquet Royale, except J-Hope's is in gold, making his cost $44,600 to Suga's $17,800. V's tastes are a bit different, as his watch is by Jaeger Le Couture, the master eight days perpetual. It doesn't mean it's not pricey, because it is priced at $21,500. Kanye West's Watches Kanye often raps about his watches, so it's no surprise to anyone he has an extensive collection. In his graduation era, he was rocking G-Shock watches, including one worth $500,000, as a collaboration between G-Shock and Bape. As his music evolved, his taste in watches evolved too. He moved on to Rolexes, like the classic Submariner. Recently, he's been spotted wearing the Cartier Crash. This unique watch has quite the story behind it. In 1967, Jean-Jacques Cartier, then the head of Cartier London, got inspired for the crash from a scorching car wreck and found that the watch laying in the vehicle had changed shape, oozing out in different directions from the heat of the blaze. The timepiece is limited to 400 pieces worldwide and has a market price of $80,000. Leonardo DiCaprio's Ruby Slippers these may be too small to fit Leo's feet, but everyone knows Judy Garland's ruby slippers from the 1939 classic film The Wizard of Oz. Garland wore four pairs, and they are all considered the holy grail of all Hollywood memorabilia. Name a more iconic piece of movie memorabilia, you can't. So in 2012, Leonardo DiCaprio, along with Steven Spielberg, had a chance to snatch up a pair for $2 million. Since then, the price of the shoes exploded. A group of collectors and and investors that brought the contest prize shoes for $666,000 in 2000 put them back on the market for a $6 million price tag. Jennifer Lopez's Ankle Bracelets 
Jennifer Lopez has a serious ankle bracelet obsession. She's paired the accessory with cocktail dresses and sky-high pumps. This isn't some dainty thing you can get at Claire's. JLo's are luxurious. She often wears an 18-carat white gold anklet totaling 6.27 carats of round, brilliant diamonds and 3.14 carats of emeralds for $10,000. If she changes it up a little bit, she picks an ankle bracelet with only diamonds for $12,000 or a $15,000 one with even higher quality diamonds. Kate Hudson's sunglasses. Kate Hudson owns a pair of sunglasses that are next level. The glitzy floral sunglasses are a bold statement piece. They have 100% UV protection and arrive in a velvet hard case. The Oyana Sergenko sunglasses retail for $1,037. Why are they so expensive? According to the brand, the details are hand embroidered. Too much or just right? What do you think? Would you spend over millions for a watch or for jewelry? Let us know in the comments below. For more videos similar to this one and the latest in pop culture, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to The Thing Celebrity.